you walk in this Minecraft world, it will just give you some crazy OP enchants. And this gets insane. Do you see this wood block I have in my hand right now? If I simply just take my steps forward, this wood block is just enchanted. This is actually insane. We got ourselves a pickaxe and I didn't want it to just be normal. Let's walk. Let's see what our pickaxe gets here. If it has efficiency, you guys have to hit that subscribe button. Let's see. Does it have efficiency? It didn't get efficiency. You Okay, you guys should still subscribe, even though my pickaxe didn't get efficiency on it. I, I can't even use this pickaxe to get cobblestone. It has silk touch. Okay, we have successfully gotten all of our stone tools, and let's just simply walk and enchant all of them real quick. Well, that is a pickaxe, and sadly, it has silk touch. Having silk touch on my items is going to be the worst because it makes it so much more difficult to mine. My axe should probably have fire aspect on it, so if I this cow oh i get the sweetest cooked beef around town ah uh, yes we found a cave iron please we got ourselves an iron pickaxe now and i'm just gonna walk for like 20 minutes and just hope that this thing just becomes absolutely just overpowered now this is how you mine in minecraft dude it's just an insta break oh there we go more diamonds lily right here hey what's up skeleton let me just stop boom one shot you and then there's more diamonds right here hey let's go more oh my that is not something i accounted for my iron pickaxe just broke all right all of our diamonds are smelted up let's craft some armor and uh tools and i'm gonna well, watch i'm gonna be fully diamond up in three two one boom there we go we are fully diamond up and now we can just get the most op diamond tools when we walk around okay nether time hey get out of here bud get out of here i'm gonna one shot you with my axe let's go to the nether let's try and find a fortress and we can just get out of here we can also leave this portal we have 10 obs how much feather falling do I have? I don't know, but it's a hopefully a lot. Wait, do I even have feather falling? I do. I have plenty of feather falling to just jump around wherever I please. This is going to be a fun nether trip. Hey, let's go. Only one heart of fall damage. I actually feel like I probably should have taken less there. Here, let's see. Does this kill me? Nope, it does not, dude. I am not scared of the nether one bit. I can fall in lava, do anything I want. It won't hurt a single bit. What I do really need, though, is more food because I I'm running low. I got four pork chops left there's a bastion wow what great timing but do i even need trades like shouldn't this axe have like looting a thousand on it i didn't one shot an enderman to be fair so it might actually not uh, oh, never mind. We got 14 ender pearls from one enderman. I think we are more than set. Can I just crit you and kill you in one shot? No. You are just a tough little cookie, aren't you? Where, wait, what? Are you not up? Where, where'd you go? And wha-bam! Oh, no! Not the lava! Oh, you're still alive. Friend, don't burn to death. I need to kill you. All right. Stop teleporting. Oh, there. Oh, I killed him. Did it? Oh, yes. It gave me more pearl. Okay. See, I, I gotta get my axe strong enough to where I just one-shot them now. Okay, can I one-shot hoglins at least? I real Wow, dude, I cannot... I need my axe to be way more powerful, but at least now we got a lot of pork chops. All right, well, I'm gonna walk while I look for this nether fortress. I want to get my axe, though, to a point where I can just one-shot the dragon. I just gotta keep walking because that... That's not a one-shot. I need one shot. That's two... Dude, Endermen are way too strong. Our looting has gone up a lot, though. There we go, the fortress! I walk all the way for my enchants. I feel like all we're gonna have to do is literally just kill one blaze, and we're gonna have enough blaze rods to find the strongholds for the rest of the time. Oh my goodness, did you hear how far their corpse just went? And yeah, we just got 15 blaze rods. You know what? Let's just kill another one just for fun. Here we go. Two more there. That's that's so many blaze rods. We literally have so many. Let's just make a nether portal and get out of here now. And out of the nether we go. Let's go see if we can find this stronghold real fast. Ooh, nice little ice lake going on here. There's literally a ruined portal right here. We got a full portal, then the ruined portal. What's in here? Not like we need the loot, but yeah. Okay, do you guys die if you even touch me? No, you don't. Wow, do you? No, wow, I am disappointed in my armor. But oh my goodness, there's a lot of you guys out here. I'm gonna walk so I can get some enchants, but goodness gracious, dude. All right, we got 16 eyes of ender. Let's see if we can find this fortress. It is this way. And it's not going to stack with the rest of them. Are you kidding me? So, a bit of trouble. Oh, wait. Dude, look how far my ice walker goes. My boots have frost walker. And look how far out that goes. That is, I honestly had no idea 
Frostwalker could even go that far. And, oh wait though, oh it's staying as ice too because we're in a snow biome, I think. But this is, no, this is just the ocean. The Frostwalker lasts this long because of how powerful my Frostwalker is. This, I didn't even know could happen. And it's only extending as we go out further. I'm gonna miss the stronghold if it's in the ocean just because of how far this releases. I just learned a, a fun fact about Minecraft. If you throw an Eye of Ender, it looks enchanted when it's up and then once you get it back, it's still enchanted. I had no idea that was even a thing, but there's a little bit of knowledge for you. Oh, my eyes of Ender are going down. Yes, so we're by the stronghold. It is literally down here. Oh, I dig faster. Than Wait, I need a water bucket. Okay, hopefully we find one down here. I can literally dig faster than I can go. Oh my goodness, this is very fast digging. Oh, water, there we go. Hey, there's the stronghold too. Okay, uh, creepers, I don't want to deal with you. I just want to find this. Dude, I could just tear through this stronghold. We need to find... Oh, the portal room's literally right here. There we go. And uh, still can't break the portal frames, even though my pickaxe is over is so overpowered. My axe does 28.5 attack damage. That is a lot. And uh, this shovel, since I've had at the start, my shovel does more damage than my axe. Should I just be using a shovel for this fight? Guys, before we go into the end real quick, comment down below. Do you think I'm going to be able to one-shot the dragon with my axe and my shovel? Because you know what? My goal is to kill the dragon without breaking any of the pillars. And we are spawning down here. And we're just going to walk. So my axe only gets stronger here. Let's get our pearls ready. And let's see if this dragon can even compete with my OP weapons. Ow! Oh, these endermen are just... Guys, don't don't run at me. You will instantly die. It's a bad idea. Just don't do it. Oh, yes. The dragon is already going down. Let's see how well our new little tools will work against him. Let's see that health bar drop, buddy. Where are you going to look? Come on. Send your way. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at it. It's destroying him. Nobody's going to heal. Okay, we're going to have to take out these towers because he's just going to keep healing. Oh, that was right on the money. Oh, oh, no. Oh, okay. That maybe I'm not as overpowered as I thought I am. That was really close. Ow, dude, this dragon keeps going after me. I've never had such an aggressive dragon in my life. And the last pillar is right here. We just got to take it out. Boom. There we go, buddy. You can no longer heal. Look how much damage you're taking just by hurting me. Dude, stop trying to hurt me. It obviously doesn't end well for you. Oh, wait. There's still a pillar left. What? Dude, this is the most aggressive dragon I've ever fought. But he's dying so much because of what he's doing. He's going after me so much that they're just dying. I keep calling it a he. I know the dragon's a she. Don't correct me down. Or, you know, correct me down in the comments below. I'm stupid. And I keep calling it a he. Oh, whoa, buddy. Oh, God. Dude. Don't do that to me. Come on, man. We can be friends. Last pillar down. And here we go. Dragon, go down to your home. Oh, wow. He actually did it. Or she did it when I asked. What a nice little dragon. Now this is your demise. Let's kill you. Where's your head? There it is. And no. Come back. No, 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 no. I can kill him. Oh, I, hey, come on. One more pearl. No. Come on. You know what? I want the last hit on her to be where she hits me. Come on, dragon, hit me. Die to your own free will by just running into me right now. I know you want to. Stop going up. No one, uh, just stop going up. Come on. Hit me, dragon. Oh, no. She's going down. She's going down. We're going to have to hit ourselves. But you know what? We're going to do it with the 33 attack damage shovel. This stone shovel can one shot Enderman probably, right? Come here, Enderman. Come here. Yes. This stone shovel will be the glory that we need. And there we go. The dragon is dead. If you guys enjoyed this video, go down below, leave a like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys all in the next one.